This is Find Your Daily Calm. I'm Sel Gaston. Welcome. Welcome to another illuminating episode of Find Your Daily Calm. Today, we're diving into the enigmatic world of Terry Lee, a pioneer who dedicates her life to demystifying the elusive and connecting the dots of what seems disconnected. Like an architect of understanding, Terry strives to bridge the worlds of scientific rational and spiritual wisdom. She takes complex concepts like yoga, meditation, mindfulness, and shamanism and distills them into a simple, accessible format for the everyday person. Think of her as a creative alchemist, blending traditional yoga, meditation, breathwork, shamanism, and mindfulness into bite-sized, 30-second body-mind-spirit exercises that effortlessly dovetail with a bustling tempo of daily life. The conventional Joe or Jane, intimidated by complex yoga positions or lengthy meditation routines, can now access mindfulness in an effortless and sensible way, thanks to Terry's innovative approach. Venturing deep into the forests of neuroscience, brain training, and neuroplasticity, Terry has emerged with a remarkable discovery, the Mosey Method. This series of seven body-mind breath exercises, each taking less than 30 seconds, can be practiced anywhere, anytime. It's like a portable sanctuary that rejuvenates your nervous system, balances your chakras, and shifts your energy. Terry specializes in guiding clients through the tumultuous seas of major life transitions, a time when the chakras are most susceptible to change and the greatest opportunities for spiritual evolution present themselves. When the Mosey method is paired with personalized, intuitive nature healing rituals, the transformative results reported by clients are nothing short of remarkable. So, dear listeners, Join us now in this active meditation and into the intricate world of Terry Lee, a realm where logic and spirituality are elegantly intertwined and mindfulness becomes accessible to all, one simple step at a time. Hi, my name is Terry Lee, and I'm a Chakras coach, and I'm honored to be your guest presenter on Find Your Daily Calm podcast today. You can find me on chakrascoach.com. Today's guided meditation is actually an active meditation. So your first thing you need to do is find yourself in front of a sink. So I suggest you go to a bathroom and pause this podcast until you get there where you're standing in front of the sink. This guided meditation exercise is based on the concept that when you link a mindful intention to a physical action and a very intentional breath, you amplify the energy of that meditation by bringing it into your body through your nervous system and repeating it several times a day to make this a new normal feeling inside your nerves. So now as you're standing at the bathroom sink, look yourself in your eyes in the mirror and take several deep, long breaths. Breathing through your nose is more calming and relaxing than breathing through your mouth. So close your mouth and breathe through your nose. And if you can, if your nose allows, breathe through the back of your nose like a very soft, subtle snore. This will calm your nervous system and get you into a state of relaxation and openness to receive the message you're about to give yourself. Now, shake your body. Shake your head, shake your hands, shake your arms, twist and turn your torso, and shake everything, just like you're a dog shaking off the water. As you shake, think intentionally to yourself, I shake it off. So you're shaking off what you left outside the door of the bathroom to prepare you to be in this moment right here for yourself. Now keep breathing that deep, slow breath through the back of your nose and turn on the water at the sink. Put your hands under the water and intentionally choose something that you want to let go of to wash away from your life 
to release. And imagine that something washing off your hands and down the drain. Imagine that something that you just shook has come to the surface at your hands and now you are washing it away. As you breathe deeply, take a moment to really thank and appreciate whatever that thing is for the lessons it provided, for the blessings it gave you, for the time that it served you in your life. And then as you wash and rinse your hands, so yes, you may use soap, as you wash and rinse your hands, you can let it go with grace and with gratitude. Continue to breathe deeply through the back of your nose in that calm, gentle way as you continue to wash your hands. You may, if you feel like this is a really difficult thing to let go, you may even wash your face as well. And when you feel like you've finished, you turn off the water, you reach for a towel, and as you dry off, you continue to do that deep, focused breathing through the back of your nose that keeps you calm and keeps you focused. And you continue to think about all the gratitude and all the blessings that this thing you're letting go of gave to you. And you dry it off. And you take away all the water. And you take away all the remnants. And you leave it in the towel. Whatever's left that didn't go down the drain is left on the towel. Now it's very important that you do not use this towel again before washing it. So either if it's a paper towel, you throw it away, or if it's a cloth towel, you wash it before your next time you come to this bathroom to use a sink. Now return to the sink and look at your own eyes in the mirror. And one more time, shake everything. Shake your whole body, shake your head, shake your shoulders, shake your arms, shake up, shake out each leg, shake everything off. And tell yourself that when I need to, when I feel this thing coming back up in me, I can shake it off. And if it feels really intense, I can come back to the sink and wash it off again. Take two more deep, focused breaths. Look at your own eyes in the mirror and celebrate. Maybe even pat yourself on the back. Give yourself a wink or a smile. Give yourself a high five or a little happy dance. Celebrate the fact that you have let this go. And know that there are other parts of it that might have to come out of nooks and crannies in your nervous system that still have to be let go. So the more you repeat this intention, the more you repeat this little mosey method, as I call it, exercise, you the more you will let this go. So I suggest you do this exercise at least three or four more times today. And you do it every single time you go to the bathroom tomorrow and the next day and the next day for at least a week. And if you're still feeling like that thing is really intense, that you really have to wash it off, then maybe try bringing it into the shower the next time you take the shower. But the more often you do this, the more often you shake, the more often you wash with this intention of washing it away and letting it go, the more you will physically shake it out of your system. And this is what I call the Mosey Method, linking a body action to a mindful intention and a focused breath. You can find more of these on my website, chakrascoach.com, or set up a one-on-one -on -one call with me to learn your own specified Mosey Method exercise for other things you want to deal with in your life. Thank you for this opportunity and for letting me share this Mosey Method exercise with you. Namaste. That was Terry Lee. She pioneers a unique fusion of spirit and science to guide us through life's seismic shifts, be it the sorrow of loss, relocating homes, a drastic career change, stepping into the empty nest phase, 
or navigating the tumultuous waters of divorce and breakups. By endorsing a journey of embracing eldership, Terry Lee ensures that her clients do not just survive these life-altering experiences but emerge as pillars of wisdom and respect in their communities. At the heart of her approach lies a groundbreaking integrative mindfulness methodology. Like a pearl formed over decades, this method is the result of an extensive exploration of anatomy, physiology, neuroplasticity, linguistics, chakra energetics, yoga, meditation, and timeless indigenous wisdoms. More details about where you may know more about Terry can be seen in this episode's show notes. So, dear listeners, as we wind down, let us take a moment to appreciate the transformative power of life's hardships, much like the caterpillar's metamorphosis into a butterfly. And remember, with guides like Terry Lee, we are never alone in our journey towards a richer, wiser life. Until next time, keep finding your daily calm.